Hello, and welcome to Let's Talk, a new series of candid conversations covering the issues facing freelance professionals today. I'm Tom Rizzo, your host, managing director and founder of Plectrum Advisors, an investment advisory firm based in Los Angeles. On each episode of Let's Talk, I'll be speaking with some of the most plugged in experts to help you and me make sense of today's changing environment and to help you be smarter about how to approach work and life. So let's get started. Our guest this week is John Bishop, founder of the jazz and classical record label, Origin Records, based in Seattle. Many of you are already familiar with the great work John's done to help jazz and classical artists get their music heard and distributed worldwide. Today, we'll talk to John about how the label works and how he came to create it. John is also a first-rate drummer, having worked with people such as Bobby McFerrin, Lee Konitz, Slide Hampton, Benny Golson, Jessica Williams, Kenny Werner, Bobby Hutcherson, Dr. Lonnie Smith, Julian Priester, Ernestine Anderson, Buddy DeFranco, Joanne Brackeen, Carla Blay, Steve Swallow, Sonny Fortune, and countless others. He's also a regular member of Hal Garper's Jazz Trio. I'm so very happy that John could join us today. Welcome, John. Thanks for being here. We appreciate it. Thanks, Tom. Great to be with you. Nice to see you. Likewise. Could you speak a little bit about what it is you do with this company and tell us why you decided to get into this. Yeah, in, in, indeed. Uh, well, it's, yeah, it's always strange to, uh, yeah, try to put a, a, a storyline behind it because it's basically just a guy who's a drummer who kind of stumbled into this and that. And then here we are quite a few years later and there's a record label attached to it. I have a uh, jazz label that's got uh, about 360 artists connected with it, 700 recordings. Uh, we started a classical label a few years ago that's uh, been going. Another jazz label, OA2 Records, that started 20 years ago. Uh, we uh, do a jazz festival once a year up here for the last 20 years. Um, and then we just get involved with stuff. This whole label developed out of uh, me being a drummer, needing to have an outlet for music. Uh, I slowly got into doing graphics for things back in the 90s and um, got a computer and started doing graphics because, you know, bands, we needed posters, we needed cassette covers, we needed whatever. Um, so I got into designing CD covers. Anyway, just figured out that uh, that's uh, uh, something that musicians need. It's certainly what I needed. All my friends who are musicians needed it. So I had this thing that could help. Mm -hmm. 